Okay. Flip. Everything's good. Okay. All right, guys. I wanted to show you the the neighborhood that uh, we're building in. Check this out. You guys are going to trip. Okay. So it's like it's quite a like a well-known area for like big houses, wealthy area. I can guarantee you all these houses across the road here are million or million plus. And uh, look it. They got two out of three. There's a third one going in, but they got two of these buildings. You guys have seen these. You've been on my channel. You've seen these. And uh, it just made me think because uh, I was on um, your Real Estate Whispers live stream. And they were talking about this. How... Uh, apartments and that depreciate the land value so this is this was uh this used to be like um uh look at a big drop drywall delivery just got dropped off um so this this neighborhood is kind of exclusive there's uh there's only like one way in and out sorry and um it's it's always been like known as like uh the you know in a wealthy area there's there's some big mansions down here i'll give you a quick little thing and then we'll we'll head over i'll show you what's going on uh let's see here hopefully everyone's doing well how's everybody it's been a minute um just getting over it awful cold too man uh, i thought i thought i had the i thought i had the the virus like the virus the covid but um i didn't so it's just, it's just a really bad cold <laughs> Uh, still just kind of fighting it off a little bit. Hey, Jelly Duck 100 is back. What is going on? <laughs> hey, Zaf. Hey, how's, how's it going, Professor X? Right on. How's Zafael, my man? Good to see you guys. Okay. All right, anyway. So, yeah, like these these are big time. Like these ones here are million plus easy. Right? Um, you got some massive, massive ones over there. Like, there's ones you think are commercial buildings, but they're not. They're actual guys' houses. And then, yeah, some the builder decided to put these here, right? Uh, which is just, uh, which is kind of funny. Uh, I'm very surprised that they would let, be allowed to build them here because this is like a, this is an exclusive neighborhood, right? Um, I just live like our neighborhood's the next intersection down in Twilliger. And um yeah, like this is even more high end than where we are by by far, right? Like um and then we got like there's up in the river like river bend and like this whole area is really nice, but <laughs> yeah, hundred um that's right, Canadian, yeah, a million Canadian, right? Oh, I guess these guys are done, so I can come in here now. But uh <laughs> We're, we're still working on uh, phase one over here on the uh, A side. It is so busy. Uh, there's so much work. There's so much going on right now that it's really hard to find guys, actually. Like, it's hard to... Uh, there's not a lot of crews in here. There's only uh, a few. We've worked on these where there's, like, a crew in every single unit, <laughs> right? But right now, there's, um, th there's not. So, there's no... no well, it's good for us, I suppose, but... Not so much for the uh, the bosses. <laughs> yeah, and they're doing the concrete, the sidewalks. We got the asphalt done, and they're doing the concrete now, which is nice. They'll have that all done um, uh, for winter, right? Uh, they're getting the heaters going. Getting the, they got the heaters, the propanes here. Like uh, they're ready. Yeah, this, um, um, Oliver. Yeah, we did uh, we did the very first job of the one of these with him uh but it was the james the six tower six story one <sighs> but yeah you see the heaters lined up ready to go for winter it's scary it's hard to think in a beautiful day like today is winter coming but yeah so yeah you can see the propane set up right those big cylinders there for the propane and these are the the heaters here I don't know. They'll put socks on them. You can see all the tubes and stuff the, to run it. Right back there. But yeah, it's looking good. They did uh, this. They did the parking lot and they're doing the concrete. Uh, they did they did really good job. Really fast. So they just finished the a truck just let, rolled out. They, they poured the main part there. 
but yeah, no, these these good crew, good guys. Um, I've been watching them go, eh? Nice clean work. How have you guys been, anyways? How's uh, how's uh, uh, everything out uh, out east there, uh, Jelly Duck? And uh, how about you, Professor X? Is that fun? Oh, good to see you, man. And then, yeah, you can see the, like there's some of the houses back there, right? Eh? Like that one straight back, the gray one. It looks like a commercial. It's all like it's got ACM uh, panels and everything. It's it's amazing. Um, but yeah, and then they, there's probably gonna. This is for the next building. There will be a third one on here, uh, but they're not building it yet. So, but you can see. Uh, Quite a quite a job, quite a job. Looks like the general actually has trailers this time, uh, because of the neighborhood it's in is is definitely more high end as well, right? So, <clears throat> but cool, right? Yeah, there's dudes. There, there's built so many of these. Um, the difference on this one, the difference, uh, the difference on this one is on the fourth floor. They got units that go nine feet, uh, which is an extra foot. They're pouring a uh, Jip Creek. Um, so instead of having it just the this flooring OSB, right? They're going to pour uh, Jip Creek, self-leveling concrete. Uh, uh, you know, you can see they have, they have these here, right? Uh, so yeah, they're, they're, they're gonna, they were getting complaints about, oh my God, guys, look. Oh. What? Oh no. So yeah, oh my goodness. This obviously we didn't do this unit. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. Oh no. Wow. Man, oh man. So hopefully everybody's doing well. Um, like I was saying, I, I really messed up. Like I was, um, uh, I was, I got a cold. I got a, I got a bloody cold and it was, oh, it knocked me on my butt. Uh, so I, uh, oh my goodness. Whoa. Um, so yeah, I'm just getting better now. Like look at all the screw holes and screws. Oh man. Oh, well, you know, there's a, there is a new crew. They're younger guys, new crew. Um, they, they just, yeah, they, they got to get practice. That's all, you know, just practice. Like, oh my, how does it get to that point? Guys, I don't know how it gets to that. Honest to God. Um, it should never get to that point. I, that, I don't understand that. Okay, like if you, like this to me is like, okay, somebody knows there's a plug in there somewhere, but they, they didn't mark it. And they just jabbed it in and went for it. But if you make a mark and the, the plug doesn't seem to be there, you go straight. And then if it, you don't hit something, you, gotta, you go straight back, okay, uh, and, and out to try to find your box, okay? You don't, you don't, this is like, wow. <laughs> No, um, that's that's crazy talk, crazy, right? Like, oh, that's that's awful. <clears throat> but uh, anyways, that's that's um, not what we're here to do. I guess pick on other guys. Which one did we do? Um, did we do this one? Yeah, we did this one. <laughs> right, you can tell the difference probably right away. <laughs> Right? Yeah, this is one we did. Oh, what the hell? Sometimes the boxes uh, in this place are out too far. And no matter where you put your screw, they pop. Uh, this is not our unit. We didn't do this. Oh, right, wait, right, wait. We didn't do this. No, no, no. We started it, but we, I did the bathroom here. Uh, I'm like, this, this is not our work. <laughs> I did the bathroom. <laughs> right? Look at see my boxes. See how clean mine are. <laughs> yeah, I did the bathroom in here. 
I, for, I, uh, I forgot, yeah, we, um, we didn't want to do this big unit because we lost lamb, right? So for two weeks. So we, we did the res bar and then we gave it up. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. We did this one though, I think, the Metro, yeah. Yeah, this is one we did here. Yeah, this is our, my unit, right? Oh, brutal, broken. But anyways, <clears throat> you can kind of tell it's uh, pretty clean work we do. All right, we have to pre-cut our windows because the um, uh, indoors because of the, the the code with the poly and stuff like that, right? So it's awesome. Learning got fixed, I think. Hmm. Yeah, baby, I think this is the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, brutal closet. Look at how dirty it is now because the, these tin guys. Yeah, yeah, this is, that's the stairwell right there. That's the stairwell <laughs> right there, right? Eh? But yeah, every unit's got these freaking panels and this thing and yeah, man. But yeah, it's drywall, drywall, drywall. Um... Which one did I do? Uh, let's see if I can remember. Well, yeah, look at how long these hallways are. We did a couple of, um, yeah, we did this one here, yeah. Yeah, this one, I, this is the one we did. And it's just me and Aaron, Aaron and I. Wait till you see the ceiling that I just did though. Holy cow. One of the most complicated ceilings there is, uh, man, it's, it's, it was crazy because it changes like, um, I'll show it to you, I'll show it to you guys. But yeah, you can see it's cleaner, right? You don't see all that big breaks and, you know, uh, the boxes are pretty clean. Returns are always set quarter inch either side type shit, you know. But, um, yeah, man, daddy's sick of drywall, man. I gotta say, like, and the the dust and everything is just getting to me, man. Lately, like, man, see how clean they clean these units are, right? Like, like, after we drywall them, how did the? Oh yeah, this is the one unit that I think I drywalled like almost the entire thing myself. I think. Yeah, um, I think I. This is the one I did. I drywalled like al almost this entire unit by myself. I mean, Aaron was here, but he was, he was he had a sore back or something. But yeah, man. No, no sheets, gravy. Every sheet, there's a cut, right? Like every single sheet, there's a cut out. So there's no gravy. The only gravy is if you get to do hallways, really. That's the only gravy, I would say. Actually, let's take the long way around. Up, well, not the long way. Oh, wait a minute. If I show you, oh, whatever. Remember the elevators? These are the, the shafts. Get done, pre-done. Right? Every floor has an electrical closet, right? Um, I would say we're doing pretty good for like the amount of people we have and like we were given her um it's just i got i got nailed with a cold right hold on here i'm just gonna get past them and it's friday All the sub trades are working on the one side well we could drive on the other and then they they come in behind after to, to run their ducks and stuff and then we go back in and do like bulkheads and uh drop ceilings and bulkheads and stuff right so you got to really coordinate with the other trades there's a lot of back and forth eh so and schedule is very critical um, this is where we at right now. Did you see Shane or anything? Have you seen Shane or anything? No, me neither. That's big A. <laughs> um, okay. 
Oh, yeah. So, yeah, we're up on the third floor. Uh, I'll go show you the ceiling. This is what you guys got to see the ceiling in this last unit. It's crazy. <clears throat> yeah, it's I, like, I'll show you why, too. Okay. Okay, so this ceiling, it just just crazy because it changes. Um, you got angles, sure, right? But it it changes the like your length, your sheet length, say, and and you like where you start from. So there's a couple of things like I could probably show you guys at some point uh, to like get your corners and stuff, like to get these angle cuts proper. You know, because you're 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 coming off that. You got to come off that wall for this one, right? And then up to this corner, you're actually coming off of this wall, going that way with your numbers, and then you switch to this way for a bit, and then uh, you come to this section, right, where it dips in and around and back in, and then it comes out on that side, right? So. Oh, it's kind of cool though. Like the ceilings are like once you get good at these, like man, you can just you can just fly with the walls, right? Um, but yeah, the faster you can think and get these numbers, you know, and get it nice and tight, like we like we do, right? Um, it's uh, it's a good skill to have for sure, right? And and uh, yeah, like angles are good. I I always kind of check my layouts on the floor almost, right? And then I figure out, like, for example, in this room, I want a bevel here, okay? I want a bevel here. Um, and so I try to actually land the bevel a quarter inch past these uh, build-outs, right? These build-outs here. Um, in this case, it didn't really work out, but most of the time it does, right? The bevel will land on over here. <clears throat> so basically what I do for second layer is I'll, I take off wherever 12 feet lands on this side, I just take that number off so that it lands a quarter inch on the past here, right? So I got, I got a nice bevel there and then it finishes into the wall. Um, but yeah, like when you're doing these things, you got to try to think about doing stand-ups as much as possible, okay? Because if you do lay downs, for example, in this closet, okay, you're, you're going to have a joint here and a joint there. And so you instead you do two stand-up eights and all you have is a little joint above the door okay it's that's you gotta keep always consider that uh see stand up here right stand up sheet here right and i actually you know there's no joint there right i have a stand up so that my joint you don't lay it down across here right and then you have a little joint here and you have a joint across the boxes right because this is where the joint would be it would be across the boxes this way it's all tied in nice Neat, right? So any wall of 48 or less, do a stand up, <laughs> right? Or in, it's not in a doorway, if you can get two, if it's eight foot or less, right? You've got to do stand up. So usually you'll like say a 32 and a 16. I think this is a 20 and a, a whatever, right? A 20 and a whatever, right? It doesn't matter. But like for here too, right? Right? The joint, little joint above the door, right? There's no joint here. No joint there. Okay, stand ups. Always put stand ups as much as you can. Here as well in the kitchen, right? We do a stand up because this joint here doesn't have to be taped at all. Okay, it's behind cabinets, so it doesn't have to be taped at all. So it is stand up so that the joint isn't right there. Right? Otherwise, yeah, because on the other side, you see how we lay it down, right? And there's a little joint. No joint for the finished side, right? You know, just a little joint there. Whereas on the other side, that joint would carry across to where the where the box is, right? So that's no good. Um, yeah, so you stand up, joint up above there, little joint, little joint. Um, um, but yeah. Right, and so too, like the 12 foot sheet, right? We don't want the joint, we don't want to come off the wall and land the 12 foot sheet right here. We want to come back, right? So that there's the joints here, you know? 
and down and down there. Wait, we just moved the 12 foot sheet in. Right? Basically what I do is I, on a situation like this, I, I immediately 45 this and I, and, and I put the sheet there and I don't even cut the, the length. Just lands wherever it lands here. And then I piece it in the end. Right? Right? No, no, never any joints in the windows or nothing, right? But look at this neighborhood, guys. Like, look. You can see the house way over there. Let's see if I can zoom in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check that out. Hey, Amos! Oh my god! Oh, guys! My, my chat wasn't working! Sorry, man. Hey, Emeran. Guys, my, my chat. I'm sorry. I, it wasn't working. I didn't see anyone. I thought everyone was just watching and not talking. I'm so sorry. Amos, if you're still here, buddy, what's up? Oh, Jelly Duck. Okay, everybody. Hey, oh, my God. I'll have to go back and watch. Oh, Don the General. Nice. Guys. Oh, I'm so sorry. I missed you guys. Jeez. Sorry. Okay. So the, um, the biggest sheet that I ever used was, um, I think just a 14 foot, just a 14 foot. But, uh, there's, I've used a 12 foot, like 12 feet long by five eighths by 54 inch wide. That is the shittiest board ever. I've ever worked with is a, it's a 12 foot sheet. So 12 feet long by 54 inches wide instead of the standard 48. Right, um, five eighths. That is a heavy, shitty, dirty sheet. Right, that is a heavy, dirty, shitty sheet. I'm so I can't believe I missed the the chat. Like it wasn't coming up. None of them, um, uh, none of them were coming up. <laughs> What's up, uh, Amaran? How you been, bro? Good stuff, man. Good stuff. Oh yeah. So um, I got the. Uh, I, I have uh, I have a couple of videos that I'm like I said it I'm I'm set up in the garage to shoot. Um, I got a couple of new pieces of gear uh, that is going to really help. Uh, I got some a wireless lav system, and um, I got uh, I got the proper dongle so I can actually uh, play like when I do the lives uh, I, I can separate the music. I can play it off my phone again, which is good, right? That's going to help. <laughs> Because this one doesn't have a phone jack, right? Or a headphone jack. So I couldn't, um, uh, remember? So I got a dongle for it. <laughs> but I also got the dongle so that I can use the wireless lab system with the phone when I go live. Uh, so yeah, I got the Osmo, right? I just, um, I, 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 I'm going to use the Osmo with the switch pod or the tripod and the, and the Ceremonic, um, uh, the Ceremonic Blink 500 Pro, right? So I'm going to, um, Oh, this is the Google Pixel I bought. This is, it's not a new phone, really. It's, uh, it's probably three months old by now. Easy, three or four months. I, when did I get this phone? It wasn't that long ago. It was long, a lot, like, I mean, it was a little while ago. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, if I go to, oh, hold on here. I need to go to live chat. Maybe that's what the phone where do rabbits go after they get married? On a bunny moon. <laughs> that's hilarious. Oh, that's funny, man. Yeah, I need to. I actually start need to put in more content. I have, I have been slacking for sure, but the the focus has been on work to get the money to to finish the studio. Okay, um, because that's the yeah we need. Like I don't like, and I don't think any of us want to be drywalling for the rest of our lives and or for that much longer. To be honest with you. It's hustle, yeah, it's hustle, all right. And then um, um, this cold really kicked my ass. And yeah, they do. So we actually, here, I'll show you across the hall. We add more. The the Joyce, uh, are they 24? They, yeah, they're 24 inch on center. And then we put the, the RC Plus 16 inch on center. Hey, buddy. The, if you guys remember, right, the sound bar, right? So we actually add framing to ha to hang it, right? Um, but yeah, the double layer five eighths is a heavy, heavy, heavy ceiling, right? So uh, the res bar is uh, 
doesn't do a lot. Uh, doesn't do a lot, if anything at all. The owners or the the tenants have been complaining about noise transfer on the online online reviews. So that's why they're adding the the concrete now, the Jip Creek. Resbar, yes, that's right, yeah. Uh, it's called um, uh, Resilient Channel, and uh, this is uh, Bailey RC Plus is the brand. Right? But yeah, that's right, my man. Yeah, all wood. Hey, wood's like, it's just so shitty to drywall. Like, <laughs> wood is the shittiest. They, they should honestly just build these buildings out of concrete and steel. They would have, they would be able to sound rate it. It'd be better, you know, like soundproof it better. And fuck, man, like it just, I don't know, man. That's why they're getting like wood is just, it transfers a lot of, a lot of sound. Excuse me. <clears throat> but yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we're just waiting for, uh, 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 four floors. So I've seen them go six floors with wood framing. Um, I think, I think now with cross laminated timber, you can actually go much higher. Uh, you could probably go 70 stories now with wood with, uh, using, uh, uh CLT, right? Uh, but for this stick framing, there is, a, there is a law. How, I think it is six stories is the highest you can go. Right? With wood, I think. Yeah, I think they decreased it. They decreased it? They increased it. In, yeah, they, I increased it from four to six. Um, but it was, it might be an elevator code I'm thinking of. I can't remember now. I can't remember. I think, yeah, you can have a walk up, uh, without an elevator up to six stories now. I think that's what I'm thinking of, but I don't know. I'd have to look it up online. I don't, I don't have that right now. I guess I could look it up on my phone, but yeah. Yeah, right. I don't understand why you would build that. I like... I mean, cross-laminated timber is a whole other story because it, it's straight and it's structural, you know? Um, the, the, the wood, like, yeah, like, I, w I would prefer to go with steel and concrete. Uh, it just makes more sense, you know? Like, uh, Q-decking and, and uh, you know, steel. Like, you, you wouldn't even have to do the, the, like, do the ceilings. Like, you, all you have to do is paint the concrete, right? Like... It's, uh, it doesn't make any sense. Like, I, I don't understand how they could think it's cheaper to do it with wood. I don't know. It, uh, it's probably not. It's, I don't think it is anyway. Um, but yeah, they, and the, the builders are pretty cheap. Like they don't, um, they don't, they don't give extra money for anything. <laughs> it's like, it's like 25 cents straight across for everything, you know? Um, and the, the, the price, it doesn't matter what you're doing. Ah, uh, right on. The, I love this. The first time I've seen the Terminator, I think. I don't remember seeing the Terminator, MRN. Yes, dude. Thank you guys. Thank you for being a member, eh? That is so cool. I don't think I've seen that before. Wow. That is cool. The first Terminator I think I've seen, man. That's sick, dude. There was a couple Hulk Hogan's earlier, but yeah, the Terminator, I think, is the next one, the next level. That's sick, dude. I appreciate that. Oh, shit. My battery's going to run out. Damn it. Darn it. Of course, as soon as everyone... I haven't seen you guys in forever. It's four unless you get lumber or special... Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's, that's right. I think it... Um, I think it, they, it was four stories and then they moved it to six now. Uh, specially made lumber. Yeah, that's the cross laminated timber. Hey, wonder. Whoa, it's been a while. How much? Uh, we're only making, well, so anywhere from 24 to, or sorry, 25 to 35 cents is uh, normal right now. So probably, uh, probably 28 cents would be kind of the average. Oh shit. That's awesome. Thanks dude. I would say 28 cents is an average. So <clears throat> yeah, it's it's like, you know, honest to God, it's not that great. Uh, drywall, man, I like it should you should be getting fifty cents a square foot. Come on, right? Like 40, 40 to fifty cents a square foot. It that that that's what we should be getting paid. So it's it's like, man, we got paid twenty five cents, thirty five cents over twenty years ago. You know, like life, everything's more expensive. It, it, it everything costs more now. And now, and and like we're getting paid less. Like, 
It's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. I don't understand it at all. But man, it's just yeah. That's that's the thing with this uh, this construction. You know, like it's yes, man. Yeah, right on. Yeah, that, I should have taken pictures. It was crazy looking at six or seven stories of wood. Yeah, dude. So if you guys do go back, I did do some live streams. You guys um, uh, would have seen the James, I'm sure. You guys would have seen the James, uh, which was six stories all wood. Um, I And I got videos on that for sure. There's stuff on my channel on the James. Uh, probably the uh, first site, uh, first very ah, merry christmas yeah no shit right <laughs> it's like fucking winter already yeah i know all the tree all the leaves are gone and it's getting cold they're getting ready they got the heaters all lined up out there and the propane's here I'm like oh man. really you gotta remind me thank god they don't hoard these in though in the winter that they that i i do not like jobs where they hoard in in the winter oh because all the dirt and dust and shit it's all like it's in the it's in you know like uh, dark and gross. I can't stand uh, hoarding. <clears throat> yeah, right on. Yeah, uh, that was the thing too. That six story we did uh, had um, uh, like the wa a walkout ro rooftop, uh, you know, flat roof. Whereas the these four story uh, are shingled. They're sloped uh, with shingles. Right? Oh, this one's flat. Oh, yeah. That's right. Yeah, this one's a flat roof. Uh, I wonder why they did that. I wonder what the difference is on the fourth floor. <clears throat> Anyways, yeah, that's crazy. So this one's a flat roof too, which is cool. Uh, they have, like I was saying, on the, the fourth floor, and I'm, and I'm guessing because of the neighborhood, they wanted to do something a little more uh, flashy for here. So they have different levels. Right, up to nine foot from between eight and nine foot. So, um, yeah, we'll we'll have to show you guys up when we get upstairs. We're on the third floor now. We'll be upstairs uh, right after this. Um, uh, right after this unit, we'll be up on the fourth floor. So, eight out of the thirteen units are going to be ready are nine foot. That's good to say. There's eight nine foot ones. Wow, I only I thought there was only four nine foot ones. Get back to work. She said, hey, Christian Hansen, how's it going, my man? Good to see you, bro. Good to see you, man. How are you? Ha <laughs> Courtney comes on. She says, get back to work. No. <clears throat> I'm waiting for my paycheck, and then I'm going to drink beer. <laughs> That's right, yeah. Yeah, the real boss speaks. No shit. She thinks she's the boss. <laughs> Fuck. Can't argue it either. <laughs> That's funny, yeah. I don't even know if it's coming today. I gotta go find Shana to see if they are coming today or not. You're that guy with the camera, he knows what's going on. <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, that's fucking awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't do shit. I just walk around and live stream and vape and just, yeah, I never do any work, really. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, my God. Uh, you're, hey, you got, you got a whole, you got the house to yourself today. No, I don't even drink Canadian beer, no. Um... I I'm I got a I got a cold uh, hoe garden. I got a I got a cold hoe garden waiting for me. Uh, where's that made? I think that's G like Belgium, Germany, or something like that. Uh, that's where that one's from. It's not. No, I don't. Uh, it's a uh, just a nicotine one. Yeah, it's just a nicotine vape. Uh, that's funny. Canadian beer. I hope from China. 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 Uh, no, I I don't do the um, I don't do the THC vape. I, I seen some guys actually do that because it's kind of low key. It doesn't smell and stuff, you know. Um, I've tried the vape, but it uh, the vape just it hits me too hard. It hits my head too hard, eh? I don't like um, I don't like it. I don't like it. Too strong. 
Dude, it's like shatter. I uh, like shatter. It's a shatter pen, you know. The well, the, uh, I I don't like shatter. It's too it's too harsh. It's too harsh. Too strong. Like it, you know. But hey, Eddie, thank you for the super chat. Thank you so much. Yeah, ready for the weekend. I'll be working all weekend. But uh, yeah, I'm ready for the weekend. I uh, um, I guess I I, I had um, last weekend off, and then Monday Tuesday I was out. Man, I, I got a cold. So I, I had like four days off and, uh, yeah, just coming back to work and, uh, just getting over this cold and, um, uh, yeah, man, cold my ass. Listen to this one here, eh? Jeez, eh? Listen to this one here. Man cold. Yeah, yeah. This one's definitely not the man cold. It's a, it was a, it really knocked me on my butt. <laughs> mom still worked. Yeah. Well, mom didn't have to hang drywall. <laughs> But we're not gonna have that talk, are we? Gonna are we, Courtney? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious! How's the, how's the girls, Eddie? I've been watching uh, Christina, uh, her videos and her streams, and um, uh, yeah, just yeah, just loving it, loving seeing her growth and everything. It's awesome. I uh, where's why does that keep doing that? Why can't I just keep it on the chat? Two still don't do it. Yeah, work is a four-letter word. Yeah, oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh man, oh man. Yeah, this is the weekend. It would have been nice though if I could have uh, if I could have uh, wrapped this up and taken the weekend off. But uh, yeah, Emeran, I'm so glad to see you, buddy. Thank you so much. So much. No, uh, it's on live chat now. It's on. Uh, it's on the live chat. So, yes, man. Yeah, you too, Amaran. Enjoy the weekend. I, I won't be on too much longer. Holy shit, I've already been on for almost 40 minutes, dude. <laughs> I do got to go back to work, though. Um, so, yeah, maybe I should uh, maybe I should take this opportunity to kind of wrap it up myself. Um, but, yeah, is there is there anything you guys want to see before I wrap it up? Uh, there's a gay bar teaching you how to quit smoking. They got a 50% success rate, if you want to know. <laughs> Oh my god, that's fucked up. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm I gotta I honestly do gotta you know, I gotta stop that vaping shit too, man. But um yeah, I do I do gotta go back to work, guys. Um I gotta go kinda figure out what's going on and uh kinda wrap the day up here and uh get on and we got till uh we gotta finish this I guess Monday we have it would be our last day. We gotta, we gotta deliver it for Tuesday. So, um, we got left time. It's, it's only like three, thirty, three hundred square feet. So, yeah, we're good. The dust and everything's been getting to me with this cold, eh? Oh, it's just so gross. But, all right, guys, I'm gonna say goodbye. Let me, let me see if I can um, go back and get the chat. Like, I don't understand why it's so hard to get the chat on sometimes. Okay. So yeah, Konaman and Amaran and Zaphiel and Eddie, thank you again for the super chat, brother. I really appreciate that. It's so nice of you to pop in and, and do that, man. That's great. And uh, Court, yeah, I'm getting back to work. And oh, what, what's this? Are you, USA screwed Canadians dropping charges on that Chinese CFO? Yeah, I know. I know that. Yeah, two Canadians spent a thousand plus days in Chinese prisons. Yep. Um, as far as I know, they're still there in, in prison too. Um, and, uh, yeah, somehow the, yeah, the U S really, really screwed us. Uh, I didn't get the full details. I, I just, I, yeah, it just rages me. So, um, I can't believe that, uh, those guys are still in prison, man. Um, that as far as I know, right. So, but uh, yeah, guys, I, Christian Hansen. Yeah, man. That's awesome. But wonder. Yeah, dude. I, I see, I see, we see wonder once in a while. Don the general. Nice. Nice. Amos was in. Very cool. Jelly Duck. I think that's it. Very cool, man. Very cool. They teach you how to suck on something else. I knew it was gonna. I knew it was gonna say. I knew it, the punchline was something like that. <laughs> right on, man. Right on. Oh yeah. So there's. They got. Look at the. You can see through the window, right? Like the guys working. That's the. They're doing the. That's how they do the concrete. See how he's flattening it out. 
And that guy's got a paddle with the long handle. Right? And they got the guys with the, what they call them, like, uh, I forget what the, like, rakes, but they don't have, they're not rakes, they're like, uh, weird looking things, but, you know. But yeah. Lots of action out there right now. But yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, you see the, the all the heaters lined up, ready to go. Like, yeah, they're getting ready for winter here. All right, I'm gonna say bye. Uh, you guys have a fantastical day. Have an even more fantastic weekend. Um, hopefully, I'll see you over the weekend again. And um, um, yeah, yeah. I'm I'm here. I'm around, and you guys know if you you know you can always get a hold of me in the comments and the Discord and whatever, right? So Friday, bro. Yeah, Mr. Rankin, 1976. Good to see you, man. I'm just about to say goodbye, but uh, yeah, man. Good to see you, bro. Hope you're well. Everything's good, and um, yeah, guys. I'll see you soon. Okay, be well and be safe. Bye for now, guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>